Hi, in this video, I'll be showing you how to monitor links on a web page using Distill. For this video, I've chosen federalreserve.gov as an example. Here, I'm on the Federal Open Market Committee's calendar page. The committee meets every six weeks and releases implementation notes, which are available in a PDF format and is also accessible via a URL. Now, let me show you how these PDFs and URL look. Let me open it in a new tab. This is a press release with decisions regarding monetary policy implementation. You can see that the link associated to HTML opens up a view like this. Now, if I were to set up the monitor to track just these two elements on the page, it would end up tracking just the text. However, there is a provision in Distill which helps you track the link associated to the text as well. Now let me set up a monitor to show you how to do this. First, I'll copy the URL of the calendar page, go to the distill watch list, click add monitor, click web page, paste the FOMC calendar URL, click on go. Now the visual selector is loading the page. I'll expand my visual selector to help you notice how the selections can be made. Now I want to track the press releases for the month of May. Now my interest is to track both PDF and HTML. Now when I click on PDF, notice how only the text PDF is being tracked. In order to track the link associated with the text PDF, I'll click on the drop down button next to text and here I will choose the attribute href. Now notice how in the visual selector panel, you will see the link associated to the PDF also load. There are several other properties that you can choose from, but in this case, let us just stick to the link. Now I would also like to track the URL associated to the implementation notes, which is tagged to the text HTML. Now when I click on my second selector on the page, which is HTML, notice how it just loads the text. Now, in order to track the URL associated to the text HTML, I will follow the same process as before. Click on the caret icon and choose href attribute from the dropdown. Now, even the URL, which is a link associated to HTML is also loaded. Now I'm happy with these two selections. Let me go ahead and save it. <coughs> now I'm on the options page where I can further configure my monitor choose a device on which I want to run these checks, maybe even rename my monitor and schedule checks at every certain interval of time. I will choose an interval of one hour and you can also set up alerts using add action. Here, these options will depend on your subscription plan. Now I'll go ahead and save my monitor. Now it appears in my watch list. Let me go ahead and run it. Now the preview shows the text and the link. However, there is a way to toggle between different types of views. The visual view will only load what is seen on the web page, which are the two text elements, PDF and HTML. If you want to see the links associated with these two elements, click on text. The view changes and you can see even the links associated to the text load up. Now let me close this and anytime uh, in the interval of one hour, if changes are detected with respect to the links, Distill will give me a notification.